Hello and welcome to K2AV's Make Pretend AV Setup Show. I'm Jasky and if you haven't tuned in previously, what we do here is we get a viewer to submit a request on how an audiovisual solution could impact their business and we come in here and we design an AV solution to improve the outcomes for that business. Today we have Jill who is the co-owner of the Tasty Pair in Bassendine, Perth. I'll let her explain what her business does and how AV could improve her business and then we'll come back here and we'll design the solution. So let's get on with the episode. Hi, I'm Jill from the Tasty Pair here in Hawaiian Bassendine Shopping Centre and we run an artist cooperative uh, selling Western Australian handmade arts and crafts. We've been in business seven years and this is our sixth shop which we've had newly renovated and we are looking for some digital solution to help us upload in real time images, products, services, maybe short videos, promos to showcase our artists in store. I think that would be useful for us. It would help our customers engage with our makers and I really see that as being a benefit to our business. We are looking to spend probably between two and three thousand dollars. Would you be able to help us with something in that budget? Thanks, Jill. Before we go into designing the solution, I just want to quickly explain what a digital signage solution is for those that may not know. A digital signage solution is essentially a TV or a screen that can then have content displayed on that screen, meaning image, video, picture, etc. The advantage of having a digital signage screen in a store like Jill's is you have an additional salesperson that is a digital version that you can control at a very small fraction of the cost. As a budget is only going to be two grand, you're not paying a full salary for a salesperson, but it functions day in and out as a sales mechanism. So for the size of Jill's store, the screen we would recommend, the screen size would be a 55 inch Philips Q-Line display. The reason for this is it is bright. It is nearly 400 nits of brightness, which means for natural sunlight that comes into that shop, it's going to be bright enough. It's also a thin bezel, so it's not going to look like a big clunky thick display on the wall which doesn't suit the aesthetics of the store because Jill's store is open eight hours a day seven days a week this is rated for at least 10 to 12 hours a day seven days a week and also an added advantage of having this screen which we would mount right behind Jill's front counter is that it can also work as a presentation or training tool we'll put a small HDMI plate next to the display where anyone can plug in a laptop or any sort of device through HDMI and then use it to just present something. If you have a bunch of your staff that you want to train, you want to just put up some information. If a client is in there and you want to discuss a product that you're talking about, very easily you also have that option aside from just the digital signage. Being a small brick and mortar, locally run store, it's not technically heavy where people have an abundance of IT skills to be able to operate something complicated. So the software we're going to recommend is the Fusion Signage software. This is incredibly cost effective, essentially a three year license is $369, which in the big scheme of things is essentially very nominal. It gives you the option of uploading information in real time. You may have an idea for a special offer, a discount, an event, some sort of thematic presentation. You can put it up immediately without any sort of delays. It is very, very easy to use. The Fusion Signage software literally has three steps. It is playlist, media, and then scheduling. So essentially you select what you want on your playlist, select the screen you want to display it to, upload your media, and then just press send or schedule a time frame. Hey, must run from eight to 10 o'clock, 10 to 12, this image runs, or 12 to one, I know a specific type of customer is gonna come in. It's incredibly customizable. And also if Jill decides to expand her store with several screens or several different stores across Western Australia, you can group your screen so they can all run the same information or a schedule of different information as and if she pleases. And the final component of the solution is the installation. The way we would install this screen behind the, the main checkout counter is a heavy duty wall mount bracket. And the screen would sit flush with the wall and it will be aesthetically very pleasing. No cables, no visual aspects of the installation. To summarize our solution. So we have the Q-Line Philips display, which will cost roughly $1,200. You have your Fusion signage software, which is a license of $370 over three years. And then the installation will roughly take about half a day and any sort of training assistance built in for 12 months at no cost. And that would cost you roughly $600 to $700, meaning your budget is below the $2,000 
as requested. And as you can see, a $2,000 solution can add a whole heap of benefits to a small store that can really impact its sales and also connect better with its clients and customers. Hope you found that episode valuable. Please share it with others that may find it useful. And thank you so much for watching.